guys, this is David from Mobix. Uh, we are very excited to present you today this new functionality that we have developed in Mobix, which is a merger calculator which is linked to CRM and books. So let me give you some insights about this functionality. What we need here is inside our Soho books, we are going to create an invoice, which is automatic, automatically synced into our CRM. After that, we are going to have some purchase orders under the expenses module, and we want to link these purchase orders based, we want to link these purchase orders into this invoice so that by the end of the exercise, we will be able to know how much money are we making in this deal. So what the system is going to do is, is going to take all the purchase orders linked to this invoice and is going to add them into a big total of purchase orders linked to this one, linked to this invoice. And then is going to calculate or is going to make a subtraction where it's going to subtract the 100% euros of the sales and is going to subtract the 60 euros of the purchase orders to give us the final margin, okay? And is going to display that information into our CRM. So that is the way it was developed. So let's see it working. So let's start by creating our invoice. So here we are in our Soho Books interface. So let's create a new invoice. So we go here and we're going to create a new invoice for our demo account. Okay. So we're going to say that we sell the test item for 100 euros. Okay. And okay, that's it. So we save it and send it. We don't want to send it for now. So here we have our invoices, the list of our invoices. And this is the invoice that we want to link the purchase orders. So we're going to copy this. And now we're gonna go to our purchase interface and we're going to create a new purchase order link to this invoice. So we're gonna click on new. Let's say that our vendor is Amazon the invoice number that we want to link is this one and we're going to buy the same item for let's say let's use the same numbers as the example so 25 euros so we save and we don't want to send it for now so we just cancel it and that's it here we have our purchase order and as you can see here it is linked to the invoice that we just selected. And if we go here to the invoices and we go to our invoice 005, we're going to see here at the bottom that the custom field margin amount is 75 euros. So what the system is doing is that it took the 100 euros and it subtract the 25 euros of the purchase order. So let's repeat the process with another purchase order. So we go to purchase order. We're going to create another one. Let's say we have a different vendor this time. And we're going to link it to the same invoice. Let's say for the same product and we're going to use the same number as our example, so 35 euros. And that's it, we save. We don't want to send it for now. And here we have our purchase order, which is linked to our invoice 005. And so we did one purchase order of 25 and one of 35 that is 60 so in our invoices we should be able to see 40 right because 100 
minus 60 is going to be 40. So we we'll refresh here. And as you can see here, we scroll down and our margin amount is 40. Very good. Excellent. System is working. Now we come here to our CRM. Let's refresh it. And if we go to the account, we're going to go to the account that we are working on, which is demonstration salt. And we're going to go to invoices. And here we have our invoice 005. So we click on it. And voila, here we have our two purchase orders which are linked to the invoice. Very nice. So now I know what are the purchase orders that are linked to this invoice. Cool. And if I go here to our, to our Soho Finance module, and we see here in our invoices, invoice 005 where we invoice it for 100 euros we can see that the margin amount oh sorry the margin amount is 40 because the system has already subtracted the 60 percent of the purchase orders very cool huh so that is it as you could see we created the invoices we created the purchase orders and we link it them to the invoice we were able to see the information in books and we were, were able to see the information in reports so that's the new functionality that Movix has developed for our clients if you are interested on it on it on any other functionality please don't hesitate to contact us thanks a lot bye